Hello, good evening. Good evening, how are you? Hi, hi. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Catherine. How are you today? Fine, fine. So, so, teacher. Which is tres del trabajo. Ay, that's so sad. Imagine. But we're getting to the weekend. You rest on the weekend, right? Yes. Or you work the weekend. We're getting close to the end of the week. Imagine Wednesday today. About to finish Wednesday. Vamos a ver, checking attendance, one minute. Amanda Yesenia, present. Calling attendance, Amanda Yesenia. Not here. Carlo Alfredo. Hi, hi. Cecilia. Cecilia, no here yet, Cecilia. César, César Antonio, César Antonio, Claudia Ivón, present teacher, Cobo Alberto, Jonathan. Present teacher. Nice. Um, Jose David. Jose David. Oh, no. Juan Antonio. Present. Juan Carlos. Juan Carlos. Karen Leticia. Karen, Karen. 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 Catherine Bridget. Present teacher. Connie. Marco Rubén. Marco Rubén. Hello teacher. Marco Rubén. Ay, Cecilia, Bye. ya voy a llamar de regreso a los que no me dijeron present. Oye, cuando lo llamé. Okay. Minor. Sandra. 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 
Silvia Estela. Present teacher. Aquí. Present teacher. Silvia, ¿verdad? Eh, Silvia Inés. Present teacher. Tatiana. Tatiana. Catherine, Catherine Beatriz. Present teacher. Ay, hoy voy a llamar a los que no me dijeron present al principio. Amanda. Cecilia. Present teacher. Ok, César. José David. Juan Carlos. Karen Leticia. Marco Ruén. Maynard. Sandra Elizabeth. Tatiana Beatriz. Bueno, yo creo que ahí estamos, ¿verdad? Todo ya. Ok, bueno. Today is our class number 16. 16. Okay. And check, today we are going to be talking about hotels. Hotels, services, and amenities. Hotel services and amenities. Those are the things that we are going to be talking about. Now look at this. This is the objective. The class will be able to plan a trip and talk about the travel services accommodations they need to make to prepare their trips. Okay, the class will be able to plan a trip and talk about the travel services accommodations they need to make to prepare their trip. Okay, now, what do you think are um, hotel services? Mm -hmm. What is hotel services? Checking for rooms. Gym. Gym. Ah, pool. Yeah. Restaurant. Bar. Mm -hmm. Uh, the river. Okay. Yeah. Different you know, rooms. Mm -hmm. Do you know what it means all inclusive? When we when we say all inclusive in a hotel, what does it mean? Mm -hmm. All inclusive. What does it mean? Mm -hmm. Remember, we're talking about hotels, right? Uh, an all inclusive resort is a holiday resort that includes a minimum of three meals daily. So if you go to an all-inclusive hotel, you will receive three meals daily, drinks and other services in the price, todo incluido, right? So if you want to use the swimming pool, they won't tell you, hey, you have to pay extra for the, for the swimming pool. And you have a, for example, a mini, there is a mini bar, 
in the hotel and you can uh, make use of that minibar, right? And it is included in the price of the, that you're paying since you enter, right? Three meals daily, drinks, and other services, right? That is all inclusive. Now, bed and breakfast. What does it mean, bed and breakfast? Remember, we're talking about hotel services. What does it mean, bed and breakfast? Uh -huh. Anybody? Anybody knows? Hey. Service school. Mm -hmm. A private home where guests are provided overnight. That's a bed and breakfast, right? It's another way of, of, of hotel service. But it's like a home, it's a private home where guests are, provide, are provided overnight. Accommodations and serve breakfast, but usually no other meals. That's just breakfast. Remember, in the all-inclusive, you receive breakfast, lunch, dinner, drinks, and any other services, right? But in the bed and breakfast, no. There, you receive only breakfast. And of course, the accommodation, right? To pass or to spend the night there. Mm -hmm. What is a lobby? What is a lobby? Lobby is yes. reception. Uh -huh. That is the reception, right? The reception area. A large near the reception, a large area. I was waiting in the lobby when I saw her coming to the reception desk. So that's a large area near the reception. What is reception? It's check, check in and check out. Uh -huh, exactly. That is a desk at the hotel where visitors or guests are received, right? where they check in and where they check out, okay? And look at the example. Hotel guests may ask for Wi-Fi passport, password at the reception desk. Okay, what is a single room? What's a single room? It's for only person. Mm -hmm. It's a room in a hotel for that has bed. a bed. It's, it's only one bed for an adult, right? What is sweet? Check it. Aquí no es sweet, ¿verdad? Sino que es sweet. What does it mean, sweet? Mm -hmm. What is a sweet? A sweet in a hotel? Ajá. Uh -huh. It's a room where it's um, have a um, big bed of, for two persons. Mm -hmm. A number of connected rooms in a hotel forming one living room. In the living room, sometimes it has two bedrooms, right? And they are big. As Sandra said, the, the, the bedroom is big. And the bed in that bedroom is big too, right? The multimillionaire is staying at the royal suite. Right? So the suite is not just one room. It's a place, right? A connected, a number of connected rooms in the hotel forming a living unit. So you have sometimes, as I said, two, two rooms and a living room. Okay, check some services. Those were amenities, right? The ones we were checking. And here we have some services. For example, some hotels offer a car rental service or catering, concierge 
courier, doctor call, right cleaning. Or if, uh -huh, dry cleaning that they take your clothes and they wash it or an area for you to go wash your clothes, right? So some places they have a, a washing machine and a dryer for you to go wash your, your own clothes. Another one is a hotel excursions and tours, right? Directed by a tour guide, flower arrangement, ironing service, laundry, and the lab service. This is what I was telling you, right? That you can find the washing machine and the dryer in a special place where you go wash, right? So you may have a laundry and have a lab. You may have a male service, massage, right? That's another in service. A room service. 24 hour service. So I don't want to go out today, please. Can you bring my breakfast to my room? That's room service. And of course you have to pay some extra money, right? For or asking for a room service. That's 24 hours. So you can ask for food or whatever you need. Eh, the 24 hours. Shoe shine service. I want to clean my shoes, okay? You call the reception and you ask for a, a shoe shine service. Ticket service, if you want to go buy, or you want to buy the ticket for the flight, you can ask the reception also to buy the ticket for you. So that's a ticket service. Transfer and chauffeur, trip and limousine services. I want to travel. Well, I'm going to travel somewhere or to the airport or to, to an event. You want to get a transfer and chauffeur for even limousine service, right? A turn down service and a valet parking. So these are some of the services that you may have when you travel, right? I check the question, what hotel services do you use when you travel? Uh -huh. So pay attention, look at the, look at the hotel services. So when you travel to another country or in El Salvador, if you need to take any, and make you some son hotel services. Which hotel services do you use? Mm -hmm. Hi, my name. Oh. Uh -huh. What hotel services do you use when you travel? What hotel services do you use when you travel? Um, Who wants to check? What hotel services do you use when you travel? You have some here, but you can also mention others. If you say, no, we do not use these ones. Uh -huh. Wi-Fi? Okay, Wi-Fi, yes. Mm -hmm. Laundry. Laundry, yes. What else? Have you have you made use of the ironing service? Mm -hmm. Yes. I don't serve the teacher. I don't service, yes. And to turn service? Turn down. Uh -huh. turn down yes, the turn down service. Train a car. Mm -hmm. Laundry. Uh, catering service. 
Teacher. Ajá. What pronunciation the imagine for for catering Which? service? O sería catering, sí. Catering service. Uh -huh. Catering. Catering service. Thank you. Okay. Ajá. Uh -huh. So have you used a uh, car rental services? No car rental? No. No? Not Catering sure. services? What about concierge? Courier? No? Dr. Cole? I remember one I one I, I used once that I was in a scholarship and we were in a hotel was the where the one where they make a call to wake you up in the morning because uh, there were two days during the week when we had to get up earlier to go to the school because the school was very far. And there was a special time when the minivan was going to arrive and pick us up to take us to the school. And one day I made a mistake and I woke up running, right? I woke up late. And as I was in a hurry, I didn't dry my hair. And I was with a terrible headache for the rest of the day because it was... It was not snowing, but it was very cold because it was snowing yeah, very far in the mountains, not in the area where I was, but around where you could see the mountains with a little snow on the top. But for me, imagine I live in San Salvador. I don't live in San Miguel, but for me, it was freezing, right? So I went with my hair wet. I went out with my hair wet because of the lack of time to dry it. And I got a headache. Then next day, I told them, please call me and wake me up at 6 o'clock in the morning, right? Because uh, we were going to bed at about 11, 12, 1 a.m. And when they change of the schedule, Everything was crazy, right? So I needed to use that service of them calling me to wake me up. But that was just okay, two, two times a week when I used that service. Okay, what other service have you done or have you used when you travel? Mm -hmm. Excursions, no? No excursions and guided tours? Yes, no. Mm -hmm. Massage. Yes, yes. Yes, the chair in the hotel, the service, the a spa. A spa, okay. Okay, okay. Another one? Mm -hmm. No more? Nobody has used room service? No. No. Okay. Tour, teacher. Tour? Mm -hmm. A tour? Yes. Mm -hmm. Dry cleaning? Have you done, have you made use of dry cleaning? What is the yes, difference? Teacher. Yes, teacher, dry cleaning. Okay, tell me, what is the difference between here, dry cleaning and laundry? What's the difference? Mm -hmm. Who can tell me? What is the difference between dry cleaning and laundry? Laundry is only wash the 
clases. Dice. ¿Cómo, eh, eh, ¿Cómo se dice? Bueno, en algunos hoteles está el servicio de buceo, porque no sé, hay unos que dan esa, como un tour de buceo, no sé cómo le llaman a eso. Buceo o buceo. Buceo, algo así. Es. Buceo. No, que algo así. Diving. Ajá, especially if you are allá en Acajutla. Ajá, diving. Yes. Mm -hmm. Another one. No more. Mm -hmm. No? No. Okay. By a look. This is car rental. You want to use a car. And you rent a car for traveling while in the city. Ironing service. Torn down service. Catering service. Laundry. I was asking you uh, what is the difference between laundry and, and dry cleaning, right? In dry cleaning, they take your clothes and they return it. Thing. But in the laundry, you go to the to the laundry room and you wash your clothes and then you dry it. There is an area like this if you want to wash your socks by hand and then you want to dry them that's okay you can do it too or if you want to use a machine to dry to wash your clothes and then you pass it to the dryer right and you can also use a concierge service i don't want to move my things please can you take them for me right that's a concierge service question no no question Remember, we're talking about services, right? Hotel services when traveling. Okay, let's read the conversation. Mark's travel agency, how can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. Sure. May I have your name, please? I'm Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Miss Puentes. How long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Non-smoking, please. Are you going to need the shuttle service? Yes, please. Now, let's repeat. Mike's Travel Agency, how can I help you? Max Travel Agency, how can I help you? Can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. Sure. May I have your name, please? Sure. 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 Of course, I'm Rosa Puentes. Of course, of course. I'm Rosa, I'm Rosa Puentes. Puentes. I'm Thank Rosa you, Miss Puentes. How long are you going to stay? Thank you, Miss Puentes. How long, How long are, you going are you going to stay? stay? I'm going to stay, stay three days. Stay, stay three days. Stay three days. Stay three days. Excuse me. Stay. 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 Are, Are you going, going to stay, stay in a smoking, smoking or, or non-smoking non non room? Non-smoking, please. 
Are you going to need the chorus? Are you going to need the chorus? Yes, please. Yes. Yes. Yes, please. By chess, please. Hey. Usted sabe que el verbo to be es ser o estar, ¿verdad? Pero cuando usted está en un lugar donde se queda por un cierto tiempo, que no es largo, ¿verdad? Por un corto tiempo, usamos stay. No usamos is o are, ¿verdad? Así es que ahí no puedo preguntar how long are you going to be there, sino que how long are you going to stay. You can use be en el caso de, you say, well, you know what? I'm going to go to, um, to, the, to the museum or to the art gallery. There is an exposition, right? And how long are you going to be there? ¿Cuánto, te vas, cuánto vas a estar allí? Ay, pero no es que se va a quedar ahí, solo va a estar un corto tiempo. ¿Verdad? Entonces, esa es la diferencia. Si yo le pregunto, how long are you going to be there? ¿Cuánto va a estar ahí? Pero, ¿durante qué? Un corto tiempo. Pero si es stay, significa quedarse. Se queda allí a dormir, a comer y, y a pasar varios días. Right? So, that's the difference. A ver, any question here about vocabulary? Question? Mm -hmm. Question. What is shuttle, shuttle service? Chorol, chorol. Es como chorol. que dijéramos aquí el Uber <ríe> o el taxi service. ¿Verdad? Ese es un chorol. Okay. El chorol service. Mm -hmm. Ok, repeat agency. 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 Reservation. Reservation. Single room. Single room. Single room. Of course. Of, of course. course. How long? 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 Stay. 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 Smoking. Smoking, non 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 smoking, al aeropuerto. ¿verdad? That's the shuttle service. Y a veces eh, la gente sale del hotel al aeropuerto, en vez de salir a buscar el, el taxi a la calle, lo piden del hotel. Right? That's the shuttle service. Ok. Again, agency. Agency. Reservation. Reservation. Single room. April 14th. 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 Of course. Of course. How long? How long? How long? Stay. 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 Smoking. 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 Non smoking. Non smoking. Non -smoking. Service. 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 Shuttle. 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 Service. Okay. Now I'm going to send you to the room so you to go practice, right? Practice the conversation. And then you will complete a couple of exercises. I'm going to show you. First, practice the conversation and then write a list of services they find 
essential to plan their next trip. Okay? Great. That's what you're going to do as a group. Great. Right Leave a checklist of services that they find essential. Le voy a quitar el ar. Yeah. That they find essential to plan their next trip. And then compare results with a partner and ask why they think they need those services. Okay, those are the things that you're going to do. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? First, practice the conversation. Exactly. First. And then, and then we were in group and we resolved to write a checklist of service. Exactly. <laughs> for playing their next. <coughs> and and compare the results with a partner and ask why they think they need those services. Exactly. The true question. Ajá, exacto, exacto, exacto. But, vamos a, a ponerles acá algo más que se me ha pasado antes de que escriban sobre ustedes. You're going to do this. Oye, say if the statements are true or false. Rosa means that I was wrong. Rosa is going to stay with me. Rosa is going to stay in a smoking room. Rosa is going to rent a car. Yeah. Okay, those are the questions that you're going to answer before, before we go to write about you. Okay. So, ahorita, on practice the conversation and answer the question. So, Rosa, ¿quién necesita Rosa? ¿Quién necesita Rosa? Mm -hmm. What? What does she room. What does Rosa need? A single room. She needs a single room. For reservation. Ajá, exacto, exacto. Bye. Los voy a mandar un ratito a los rooms. Un ratito a los rooms for you to practice the conversation and answer the questions about Rosa. Vamos a venir a compartir y después lo vuelvo a matar. Good afternoon. Let's see. Ok. Amanda, so sorry to hear that. Bye. Ok. Vamos a ver, chequen si se logran unir, Sandra. Vamos. Let's see. Try to join. Take turns practicing the conversation with all the people in the group, okay? Hola. Ah. Son varios, ¿verdad? Take turns practicing the conversation among you. Okay, teacher.
-huh. No los oigo. No, es que estaba buscándola para compartir la conversación. Aquí, aquí, está, se, aquí se las pegaron ya en ah, el chat. ¿A dónde? En el chat de WhatsApp. En el chat de WhatsApp. Las pegó John. No, yo no tan pude compartirla, por favor, aquí en Zoom. Pero es que Jonathan, no ah, sí, aquí está Jonathan. Jonathan no está aquí, le voy a decir. Sí, ahí está. Sí, ya lo no Permítanme, quiero ver, compartir imagen, ¿verdad? Foto. Uh -huh. No lo que ella quiere es que comparta. Quieres compartir la pantalla. Ajá. Ay, como ah, me agarró sí. con la boca abierta. No. <risa> Haga otra captura. <risa> Por andarme riendo, mire. Qué barbaridad, dicho. La puede como acercar más. Para que no por vea favor. la dicho. Sí, por favor. Ahí está. Se va a ver más, más grande va en la boca. Allí. Ajá. Yeah. Much, much better. Ajá. Ahí. Ahí ya la veo yo. Las demás la ven. Yo, bueno, no, la mejor la voy a usar de WhatsApp porque igual. Este, no logro verlo, ver la letra. <risa> ya me falla bastante lo que es la vista. Pero igual, aquí la, ah, vaya, ahí está, ajá. Ahí sí la logro ver. Vaya, y empiezo, empiezo. Sí. Entonces, ahora el exercise P. Okay. Yes. Rosa needs a double room. False. False. Rosa is going to take it to them. Yes, I think. Yes, true. True. Rosa is going to stay in a smoking room. False. False. Rosa is going to bring a car at the airport. False. Oh. Oh. She needs a shuttle service, but now rent a car. Okay. False. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's all now. It's finished. The other is we have to check list of service. Uh, they find a safe to plan the next step. Esas eran otras preguntas, ¿verdad, Sandra? Sí, son las otras dos que ella colocó, pero solo copié la primera. Checklist of service de plan essential to plan the next trip. No, ya le tomé la captura. Write a checklist of service they find are essential to, pl to plan their next trip. Okay. 
Y la siguiente, ¿cuál era? Compare results with a partner and ask why they think they need the services. What service we need for the next week? For me, uh, I don't know. <laughs> service? <laughs> Room. Room service? Room service. Cool. Short service for the airport to the hotel. Ah, uh, yes. Um, laundry service. Laundry. Single single room or double room. It depends if if you go a lot. A lot. <laughs> single room, but if you you go with your coworkers or the family. A suite or a double room. Yes, a double. In some hotels, have a room for four people or it depends. Six. Yeah. Yes, six, six people. Okay. This topic. <laughs> what are others? Ladies? Buffet. If it's if it's in another country, maybe the the ticket. The ticket, yeah. Include with the. Include a, a, a breakfast. <laughs> All <Lunch>. the meals. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. the, the more <laughs> All the work. Do you go to another place? Or did you go to another place? In San Salvador or how oh, the country? <laughs> uh, no, sir. No. I'm camping outside the hotel, but in the hotel, no. We are staying in a Hi, hi. Did you finish? Finish, finish. I teach you, she just teach you. Okay. Now, let's see, you were reading the conversation. And now, tell me. 
Eh, Rosa needs a double room. True false. False, teacher. False. How many rooms does she need? For a single. A single, yes. She needs to, to make a reservation for a single room. Okay. Rosa is going to stay for three days. True or false? Rosa is going to stay for three days. Is that true? Is that false? Mm -hmm. it's, false. it's false. It's true. It's true. It's true. It's true. Exactly, that is true. Rosa is going to stay in a smoking room. Or false. False. She said non-smoking, right? Rosa is going to rent a car at the airport. False. False. Will she take a shuttle? Oh, yeah. Will take shuttle service. Okay. Okay. Bye. What is accommodation? What is accommodation? Tell me. What is accommodation? A place such as a room in a hotel where travelers can sleep and find other service. Exactly. A place for when, for sleeping, right? Can be a hotel, can be an Airbnb, can be a motel, a motel, not the ones that we have in El Salvador. Right? When you travel, when you travel to another country, they have motels, but with a different connotation. That's a place where people can rest, right? They, they go on their way because they have to drive uh, very long distances. And the only thing they need is a place to clean and a place to sleep, right? So then they are looking for accommodation. That, that would be a good place near the way where they can go sleep take a shower the next day and continue the, the driving, right? That's accommodation. Can be a hotel, right? A room in a hotel. Can be an Airbnb, can be any hostel, right? Anything that could be good for travelers to sleep, right? And then they can continue with their ways. Amenities, what is amenities? The feature of the hotel that are available for guests to use. Exactly. Example, gym, a pool, a minibar, a jacuzzi. Mm -hmm. Those things that you may find in the hotel that will help you be more comfortable, right? Mm -hmm. If you go to the hotel for just one day, you can survive a day without the gym. But if you stay in the hotel for a week or two weeks, for those people who, who are always go to the gym will be like, I know, how can I be? Teacher, in the first it says accommodation, right? Yes, accommodation. In the second, amenities. Amenities. ¿Esa se usa para cuándo? Es plural. Sí, amenities siempre va a ser plural. Pero cuando pido en plural para, para más personas. No, no. La palabra amenities es plural. Uh -huh. Y el gym, la swimming pool, ya gym es, es singular. Pero la palabra amenities es plural. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Esa palabra es plural. 
Then when when the hotel offers amenities, no, they say amenity only one, right? They mention the amenities. Pero accommodation will be a singular word. Mm -hmm. So when we mention amenities, we're talking about those things that the hotel has that help you feel more comfortable, right? Especially if you're staying for a long time. So they have a team, a pool, a mini bar sometimes. If not a mini bar, they may have a, a place for you to, to, to stay, to rest. I remember the hotel where I stayed, uh, we stayed in the hotel for about nearly six weeks yeah, because the, the, the scholarship was for seven weeks. And the hotel had a gym. I never got to the gym, but there was a gym. So I went to the gym a couple of times, right? It had a pool. It had a jacuzzi too and a sauna, right? Uh, but it was difficult to go to the sauna because you entered the sauna. It was very hot in the sauna. And then you went out and outside was freezing, right? So it, it was impossible because the sauna was like uh, outside, out of the roof. So you enter the sauna, it had a roof, right? But, it had, uh, but then you had to go out of the sauna, receiving all the, the air of outside, and it was pretty cold. That's why I never went to the sauna, but I went to the jacuzzi and I went to the swimming pool and the pool. It didn't have a mini bar because I don't know why, but it didn't have a mini bar. But uh, it had a refrigerator right in the in the in the room. There was a refrigerator, but it was not a small one. It was like a normal refrigerator where we could keep our food, but also a part of of the, uh, the refrigerator that we had in the room. We could count with a kitchen, so you we could go to the kitchen. If we wanted to cook our own food, we could go and cook there in the kitchen. That was part of the amenities that the hotel was offering uh, because they didn't offer breakfast, lunch, or dinner. So they didn't offer any meal. That's why it counted with a, with a, with a kitchen in every floor, right? Because they said, well, if we do not have a... We do not offer food. What they offer was only coffee. Early in the morning, you could find their coffee, juice, and bread. It was like some bread like this. They were made of apple. That was very good. But there was no, no, no breakfast, right? So that was just the bread, bottles of juice like this, apple juice, the coffee, and tea. For the people because it was like an exchange of different teachers of different countries and many people didn't drink coffee like they drank tea then there were different types of tea for the people who didn't drink coffee during the rest of the of the day uh, there was no coffee already prepared but there were bags of coffee for you to go prepare your own coffee there was hot water and cold water. So if people wanted to make their own coffee or tea, they were offering that uh, service, right? Instead of having a mini bar or a cafeteria or somebody to make the coffee for you, you could go make your own. And that was in an area where there was a, a how can we say, a common, we could call we call it a common area. Yeah, that was a common area. This was in this common area. People could go if they didn't want to stay in their in the room in the hotel. 
they could go to this common area. So they could eat here because there were tables and chairs and everything. The coffee was closed. So they could go sit down there, right? So that was this common area, like you will say like a, like a space like the cafeterias that we have here, right? So that was the common area, okay? That was between the amenities that you will find. So those are features, we can say, features that the hotel offer the guests, right? They are available uh, for all the guests to, to use them at any time. And they are all included. Remember at the beginning, we were saying, uh, we were checking the word all inclusive, right? That you don't have to pay extra. You don't have to pay extra uh, for the things, right, that you have in there. Any questions here? Questions? Not. Mm -hmm. Okay. Bye. Now that we know about services and amenities and things that we may find in a hotel, I'm going to give you a couple of minutes. I'm going to change your rooms, right? for you to make a checklist of services that you may find essential to plan your next trip. What are those things or those services that you may find? Yeah, you can say it can be both or services or amenities. I'm going to show you the, the the checklist that you may find there in the manual that can help you write your list there. When you finish, you will compare with your partners, right? Why do you think those services are necessary or are important to you? Okay, but first you go make the list. It's this one, yeah? So you may have like, okay, we need a team. Ha, huh, but you never go to the gym. Why do you need a gym at the hotel when you travel, when you are traveling, right? Or if you say, well, I need a gym because I always exercise every day. So I need to continue being fit and I'm going to be at the hotel for a week. So I need to have that amenity. Okay? But I'm going to send you to the rooms. Remember, write a checklist of services that you find essential to plan your next trip. Okay? Questions? Questions? No questions. No. I am going to make. I am the same. Great. Este tema está menos feo que el de la vez pasada. Está más sensible. Bye. Vámonos, pues. Let's go join. What services do you, think, do you think are important for you or essential when traveling? Join. Try to join. Hi, hi. Mm -hmm. Hi, 
because I is mass economic to cook for all mm -hmm. and the people ah, they are uh, buy uh, your your food. The, the the hotel for me is important, but depend of the how many days, the place. Yeah. Example is important the Wi-Fi internet. <laughs> Okay. Wi-Fi. Yes. Yes. So. Yes. It's uh, essentially. Yes. Hello, Juan. Juan. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> and then they are all inclusive for the the meals. It's important. Because it's expensive, the food. Okay. Or or maybe a, a breakfast time, but one meal. A single room. When, well, a single group, when is uh, the group is for two or three people. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, a safe, safe, uh, sería box safe, teacher, algo así como caja de seguridad, o safe. Sí. Sí, me veo. Sí, ¿qué? Sí, sí. Sí, un diccionario, ¿por qué? No, otros cosas tan cualquier cosa. Yo vi bastante bien, Toña. Si te pongo el Joan, Wendy. No me convence este, fíjese que dice eso. Eh, bueno, se puede tomar como seis únicamente. Seis. Seis. Uh -huh. Sí, a seis. Solo safe, porque lo demás lo siento como demasiado literal para que vaya. Uh -huh. Ya safe. Es importante a safe in the, in the room. Oh, yes. If not in the, in the room, at least eh, in a place where you can leave your things, right? Yes. And then a uh, sure all service depend the the oh, hotel oh. or the place uh -huh, or the place. In some hotels they put the item in the room. The item is true. Yeah. It's true. They may have an item. And how do you say secadora de pelo, teacher? A hair dryer. 
Uh -huh. That's another, another thing. Yes. En pantuflas. Those are slippers. Slippers. En bata. <laughs> A bat. bat. Bathrobe, si no me equivoco. Bathrobe. Bathrobe. Ajá, cabal. No sé, está muy correcto. That's a bath. A bath rock. Okay. Thank you. Depende de ahí, is, is important the laundry service. Ah, yes. Yes, especially if you're going to stay many days, right? Okay. You're going to stay only two days, no problem. But if you're staying a week or two, in your case, when you uh, stay in the, in the hotel, you have a laundry service. In the hotel where I stayed, they had a laundry service. And you cook. I cooked sometimes, not all the time, but on on that time when I went, I had been on a diet, you know. And I used to make for breakfast, I used to I used to make cereal, sometimes cereal with milk. So as we had a refrigerator in the in the room, there I kept milk, yogurt. I bought apples, strawberries, fishes, and pears. So that's what I caught in the morning and I made with yogurt. Or if no, I ate cereal with milk. What we usually cooked, if we were not too tired, was dinner. Because okay. by lunchtime, we were at the university or at the school, right? So we were not there in the hotel. But at dinner time, when we arrived, we ate and we prepared. Sometimes we prepared dinner. Or we bought lasagna ready just to put in the, in the, microwave. In the, in the oven. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so we could, we cooked the lasagna there. So that was like, we, because we could buy cheaper food <laughs> instead of being there buying the prepared food because the plate was expensive. One lunch was about $8. One lunch. Imagine and being spending $8 every time. That was very expensive. In which country are, are you? I the... went to the, to the United States. I was in Reno. Ah, okay. But it was a small hotel. Uh, so it, that's why it didn't offer any meal, just the, the coffee, tea, and a, a juice, right? Or our apple juice and a piece of bread early in the morning. So that was no breakfast, right? But at least it was something that we could take to eat in the way. Is that similar in Costa Rica? Uh huh. They are breakfast very healthy. Very Fruit. healthy. Yes. Fruit, juice, tea, milk. But uh -huh. it's the it depends the person. Uh -huh, exactly. Exactly. There they didn't put the fruit. I went to Walmart to buy fruit and we and I had fruit in the refrigerator. Okay. Mm -hmm. So that's why I was, I was ready. But something I really missed was beans, because I eat beans every day in my house, right? <laughs> but there, there were no beans, so it was sad because it was like no oh, one want to. And they took me to a place where they said, "Here you will find beans." 
Mexican beans are not the same as the beans we eat. Oh, it's, it's, they, were, it's they are all looking very old, so I didn't like them. I, I, I went to Germany and the, the beans are for Africa. It's terrible, terrible. Totally terrible. different, right? Totally, yeah. totally different. Yes, no, no. Nothing like our Latin American beans. <laughs> Completely different. And with the pupusas too. Yes. Because sure. I made pupusas because I can make pupusas. I made pupusas for all the teams so they could try the pupusas. That there was no quesillo, right? So I bought queso Oaxaca and mozzarella and that's what I combined and I made the pupusas. But they said, wow, these pupusas are delicious. And I said, mm, I struggle with the cheese teacher because all the cheese is like a, como se llama, como deshidratado. Sí, sí, sí. Uh, it's terrible, the taste. <laughs> Well, yes. My, my experience was terrible. In this Imagine, country. yeah, because we were completely in another continent, right? So, yes. Uh huh. So that was. I mean, the cheese. Yeah. I made very frijoles molidos. Uh huh. Did you find? No, I carry. Oh. I carry. Ah, okay. No, I didn't carry anything. I was not thinking about food. <laughs> I didn't <laughs> carry anything. So at the moment there, was like, ouch. But I found uh, beans like that, as you said, in bags, right? Mm -hmm. The fried beans, just for, to prepare them. That's what I use for making the pupusas. Okay. I found chicharrón too. Chicharron already prepared to make pupusas. And I made some others of ayuti. Because some people from Asia said, no, we do not eat. We don't eat pork. We don't eat pork. So for them, I prepare ayote and beans, pupusas. Mm -hmm. Okay. Because because of their religion, they said, no, we do not eat. And I said, okay, no problem. I don't eat pork either. Like that, the chicharron, like that, I don't like it. I can eat pork in different ways, like the pupusas, the ribs, but no chicharron is like that for the pupusas. Mm -mm. I don't Did like you the, the room? We shared room. We were doing it in a room. I shared my room with a Thai girl. Totally different. She was awake in the middle of the night, talking with her husband who was in Japan. <laughs> and at that time, but no, she was she was awake. At, what can I say? About three, four in the morning. Imagine, and I had gone to bed at about 12, 1 a.m. And then she woke up at 3, 4 in the morning laughing. And her Japanese husband was laughing. And he was like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because of the times, they were totally different. And the customs. But we got along very well at the end. We did a lot of things together. Okay. She, she taught me to dance, Thai dance. <laughs> of course, now if you ask me, I don't know anything, right? But <laughs> yeah, it was a very nice experience. But pues lo dejo, so you finish. And I call you in a couple of minutes, okay? Okay, sure. Thing. Why not? Bathroom, ¿cómo se escribe? Bathroom. No voy a comprar medicina. Bathroom. Bathroom, Cecilia. Sí, ¿verdad? Sí, sí. Bathroom is B-A-T-H-R-O-O-M. 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 B-A-
R O O M. Uh -huh. R B uh -huh. R O O M. 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 Así, ¿verdad? M de mamá. M. M. Uh -huh. okay. Pero el bathroom es como mandatory. Yeah. Un hotel que no tenga baño, uy, yo me voy. <risa> eh, Podría ser mejor jacuzzi. jacuzzi sí, no sí. O, la bath, o, o si quiere, bato. ¿Qué es eso? Latina de baño. Ah, Ajá. That in some places they have a bato, and in other places they have a shower. Ajá. Así. Top. No, quítele la OM y póngale top. T U V. Quítele ¿Y? la O, quítele esa O. T U U U U U B. A bad bar. B. Eh, eh, o esta. No, la otra. Ajá. Esta. A basto. A basto. No, la B de buzo. <laughs> Así. B, porque esa es B. Ajá, Así. bathtub, exactly, bathtub. Oh. El bath, in some places they only have a shower. In some other places they have a bathtub. Or they have mm -hmm. a bathtub with a shower. Right? Okay. Mm -hmm. La tenemos que hacer tres, tres listas o solo dos. Only two, it's okay. Ok, teacher. Vamos a completar la última cuando le preguntemos a los compañeritos. Ya, ya. Oye. Uh -huh. Claudia le puede tomar captura, please. Hi, hi. Hello, teacher. Hello, did you yes. finish? Yes. Hi, yes. Yes. Ok, ok, vámonos entonces. Ok, we're back. Okay. I'll see. Everybody back. Everybody back. No, yet. No, but that. Okay. Now, I know you completed a... You completed two things, right? So what well, you completed your own list and your partners asked you and they completed the other list. So what we are going to do here is that as you are listening, you complete the last one, okay? A ver, tell me, what services or amenities do you think of or do you think you need when you travel? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Room service. Room service, yes. Room service. What else? Uh, teacher, uh, también I need shuttle service. A shuttle. A shuttle service. Sí, por sí. Shuttle se pronuncia como? Shuttle. 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 
como que si fuera O en vez de U, Choro. Ah, Choro. A Choro Service. Sí. What is? A safe. A safe. Yes. Laundry. Laundry. Yeah. A swimming pool. A swimming pool. Sí, pues sí. A swimming pool. Ok. Bye. Cheque. Si usted no tenía alguna de estas cositas, la va agregando en, en, en la otra lista. Right. Ok. So we have room service, shuttle service, safe, laundry, and swimming. Now let's move to the other lists. What else do you do you have? Single room. Okay, single room. What else? Would you like a sauna? No. No sauna. Yes. yes. Travel. What do you say? Massage. Guys. Hmm? Guy of give give travel. I don't know the pronounce here. Travel. Or silly. Guía turística o turista. Sí. Aturgay. Sí. Aturgay. Ajá. Do you want all included? Breakfast included? No. Yes, teacher. Yes. Or oh, no food, you can eat outside, no problem. <laughs> yes. All included or just breakfast? All included. All included. Van a llegar a almorzar. <laughs> Please. Okay. <laughs> All inclusive. Okay. Porque, sí, recuerdo otro hotel yo. Y el mamá mía, pues más que dinner. In order, there was only breakfast. Right? Yeah. So it depends. And the other small one that had nothing. Right? So it depends on what you want. Jacuzzi dice. Okay. What else? Wi-Fi internet. Mm -hmm. That's important. Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi. Yeah. Very expensive. Very, very expensive. They charge you about $10 an hour in Washington. $10. Imagine paying $10 for Wi-Fi. But there is, a, there is an amenity, or if you want to count it as a service, there is an area, I don't remember what they call that area, but there is an area where they have computers, where you can go use the computers for free, when for free, because you are already paying. But uh, you can go if you want to send an email or answer an email or do whatever. You can have that service of computers because if you want to, to have internet more time, you have to pay $10 the hour. But those computers that are part of the, of the, of the hotel, those are free, right? So somehow it's better. Okay, what else? Mm -hmm. What else? What else? If the trip is in another country, need a ticket. Okay, ticket. ¿Cómo se llamaba este? Vamos a ver. 
¿Cómo se llama el de? Ah, ticket service. Okay. Ticket service. Yes. What else? We almost finish. Anything else that you would like to have? No more. That's enough. Teacher. Yeah. I pull. What did you say? Pull, pull las piscinas. Sí, pull. Mm -hmm. Pero ya habíamos puesto pull, ¿verdad? En la anterior. Pusimos swimming pool, sí, ya. Ah, minibar también. ¿Mm? Minibar también. Ah, minibar. Pero usted anda trabajando hoy. Sí. <ríe> yo voy aquí, ahora, yo voy aquí. ahora hasta la bebida la sirven, hasta la bebida la coca, la soda, eh, todo eso lo sirven ahora desde el mínimo. Really? Ok. What else? A single room teacher. Single room, ya le pusimos al otro. Ah, yes. It's already there. Discotex. A Tesco. Ok. Bueno, es como parte de las amenidades, ¿verdad? Ok. Como el de Cameron. A buffet teacher. Yeah, please. Yeah. All you can eat. That would be nice. And all you can eat. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you. By a check. Now that you have clear all the things that you want when you go on a, on a, on a trip, it's your time for you to make your conversation. You're going to work in pairs, right? So you can dance in pairs together. And you're going to make a conversation. Check. Create a short conversation, calling a hotel. So you're going to call the hotel and confirming that they have those services. And then you make the reservation. Ve al el example that I have here. I would like to make a hotel reservation. What day will you be in? Or what day will you be arriving? I will be arriving on May 14th. Hmm. How long will you be staying? I need the room for three nights. How many people will be staying in the room? I will be staying in the room alone. Would you like a smoking or a non-smoking room? Well, we need a non-smoking room. We need a book, we need, we have to book, we have booked a room for you. Please be sure you are right before four. Right, that is an example. But you can also remember call and ask, excuse me, I want to book a room for two, right? Or I want to book a room for three, if you are with your colleagues, right? And I would like to know if you have a, a gym because we need to exercise. We will continue exercising. I would like to know if you have a gym, if you have a, a kitchen, what I can do. So imagine that you're looking for the best hotel before you make your reservation. And then, of course, you make the reservation. Okay, I'm going to give you okay, about 10 minutes for you to work, prepare your conversation, making a hotel reservation, and then I call you back. Questions? 
No questions. Remember, you want to book a room in a hotel because you're traveling for business with your colleagues. Okay, there we go. I'm going to send you in a different uh, group. Me quedan uno de cuatro. No sé, no sé, Carlos Alfredo, no le he oído hoy. No, teacher. Ah, vaya, vaya, vaya. Estaba pendiente. <ríe> Escondido. No. Pregúntele a los compañeros. Vaya, vámonos pues. No, espérenme que voy a agregar un poco más de esto. Para que no quede tan grande que pues esa conversación. Sí, si por casualidad su compañero se pierde, immediately call me, right? Ya está solito. Yo estoy mandando tres, pero como se, se me pierden de repente, ustedes me avisan hoy. ¿Ready? ¿Qué vamos a ir a hacer? Create a conversation. Mm -hmm. Create a conversation. Making a hotel reservation. Van a ir de viaje por business. No es hobby, no vamos de vacaciones. Vamos por business. Pero igual no quita que usted no se divierta mientras está libre, ¿verdad? Ok. There we go. Join. Join, join. Catherine, 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 Beatriz. Vaya, Catherine, Beatriz y Catherine, Beche, se pueden quedar aquí si, si no se logran unir hoy. Aunque. Veamos, Beche, no le aparece la, 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 el grupito para unirse, la manda a otro grupo. Catherine, Catherine, logra ver el grupo todavía para unirse. Hola. Uh -huh. No. Vamos a ir en el otro grupo a ver si le si aparece. Check. Internet. Teacher. La conversación íbamos a practicar, ¿verdad? No, van a ser unas ustedes. ¿Una, perdón? Ustedes cambienle todo lo que le quieran cambiar y hacen su propia conversación. Yo y las que van de viaje son ustedes. Ah, ok, teacher. Ustedes van de viaje y quieren eh, hacer una observación de un hotel. Cecilia. Uh -huh. Entonces, sí. Veo que me escribió. Aquí estoy. <risa> Sí. Dígame. Liz. <ríe> ah, ok. Va, ok, ok, ok. Vamos a jalarnos. Me siento por acá. Hello. Amanda, hi, hi. Amanda tiene migraña. Hoy, oh, Katherine. 
Catherine creo que tiene problemas con el INTER o algo así. ¿Verdad, Catherine? Hello, ahorita sí ya les escucho. A ver, a ver, lo creo. Vamos a hacer nuestra propia conversación. Sí. Sí, sí. Uh, quiero ver. Cámbienle todo lo que quieran cambiarle, oyen, son libres de cambiar. Hello, thank you for coming, Golden, señor. Bueno, aquí le vamos a poner all forces. Solo los nombres de los Quiero ver. Aquí le podemos poner Ajá. Mis es señorita, va. Sí. Y aquí vamos a tachar. ¿Qué más le cambiamos, Caterin? La fecha en que va a llegar. Ok. Tenemos teacher. Espérenme, teacher, algo hice aquí. ¿Cuántos días se va a estar? Podría ser, ah, uh, vamos a tachar. Quiero ver, I'm going to a high, ah. Uh, Vamos a cambiarle esto. Ok, vamos a ponerle. Todo este. Oh, no. Todo este. For long are you going to stay with Mr. Miss? Miss. Stay, Catherine. Y ahí podría Me ir. Quiero, ¿Cuánto tiempo vas a estar? Ajá, exacto. Ok. Ok. Ajá, don Alvarado, ¿cuánto tiempo vas a estar? Y se fue, mire. <laughs> ¡Ey, se fue! ¡Huyó! <laughs> Me gusta. Okay. Okay. No okay. Me sí. Entonces me voy a poner eh, we porque somos varios, ¿verdad? We, we are 
We we are going to two days. To stay today. Two days. Okay. Y entonces ahí podría qué pregunta. Are you need business center? Okay. Mm -hmm. This is a, yes, please. Okay. Y luego, ¿cuál podría ser la otra pregunta? Podría ser... Eh, bueno, no, porque sería... Si ¿sí necesita transporte o si ¿sí necesitan rentar carro para no poner... Se, como se supone que de... de, de... Empresario. Ajá. Quizás preguntarle, ¿Are you need computer? Por, no sé, es, ¿Cómo que se llama? Por los proyectores o por si hay alguna reunión. Sería, ¿Are you need? ¿Qué equip? No, technology equipment o equipment technology. ¿Cómo sería? Teacher, how do you say el retroproyector o el proyector? No sé qué es. Sí, sí, está. What are you need computers? Pongámosle así. Computers. Ajá. Eh, es como proyectores son, ¿verdad? Sí, proyector sería proyector. Sí, proyector. Proyector. Uh -huh. Ok, a proyector. Alguien en el computer, el proyector. Oh, no, quizás solo el proyector, ¿verdad? On another. Equipment. Ajá, así sería. Okay. Y ahí podría ser. Y only. No. Ahí, oh. Only a proyector. Yes. Así. Only a proyector. Y podríamos poner, also, I need coffee and tea. Also, also I need, or oh, we need coffee. Uh -huh, we need coffee. Coffee and tea in the business center. The room for why night. How many people will be staying in the room? I will be staying in the room for I will be staying in the room three people. Would you like a smoking or no smoking room? With me a no smoking room. We have booked a room for you. Please be sure to arrive before for your checking date. Okay. 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 No le podemos agregar más, ¿verdad? Sí puede. Teacher. Sí, claro, pueden cambiarle, pueden agregarle lo que quieran. Both booked, booked, ¿cómo booked. se dice ahí? Se pronuncia. Booked. Booked. 
¿Qué significa eso? Reservar, hemos reservado. Mucho. Mucho. Y ah. staying. Staying. ¿Cuánto staying. tiempo se va a quedar? Ah, ok. Si quiere, bueno, le voy a volver a preguntar. Jonathan. Ok. Vaya, empiece. Y le van cambiando. Uh, okay. uh, uh, would you like uh, your room uh, dry clean? O, o, ¿Cómo se dice? Tí? Laundry. Laundry. Yes, I like. Uh, you need a uh, Wi-Fi in your in your room. Yes, I need Wi-Fi in my room. Okay, Mister. We have a booked a room for you. Please be sure to arrive before four. On book, bushed, me dijo, verdad? Like, book. book, book, we have a book, book, a room for you, please. Be sure to arrive before four on your checking date. Okay, okay, thank you. Cambiemos los roles la última vez, right. Carla. Ok, entonces este sería el A. Ahora. Ajá, cambiaron yo para, la presenta, para la conversación de ustedes, ¿verdad? Sí, Poquito. sí. Ahí vamos. Ah. Poco. Ok, perfecto. Bueno. Thank you for call us. Ah. We waiting for you. Ah, very kind. <laughs> Okay, thanks. See you soon. Thanks. That's all. Okay, it's okay. ready. Hello, teacher. Hi. Hi, teacher. Hi, hi. Solo veo a Carlos y mi noche. Hi, hi. Oh, yeah. Are you ready? Estamos pataleando. <laughs> Silvia. <laughs> Teacher, ahí vamos a hacer, por ejemplo, nuestra propia conversación de viaje o algo por el estilo. Exactly, exactly. Ok. Vámonos. Démosle. Pues. <ríe>
Hablando Muda fue yo. Vaya, who will be my first volunteer? My first pair. Mm -hmm. A ver, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Do you want? Okay, nice. Silvia. Sandra and... Hola. Bien. Silvia. 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 Okay. Mm -hmm. Do you want to... Okay. Ser víctima. <laughs> ya me di cuenta. <laughs> okay. okay. Good morning. Hello, Ghost Travel Agency. How can I help you? Uh, good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I go to travel the Guatemala on April uh, 20 ish. Sure. May I have your name, please? Eh, of, of course. O a dónde? Perdón, Sandrita, no la escuchan muy bien. Sure, may I have your name, please? Ah, of course, I am Estela Molina. Thank you, Miss Molina. How long are you going to stay? I gonna stay for date. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non a smoking room? No smoking, please. Okay. Are you going to need other service? Uh, yes, I need uh, the service, the gym. Sería uh, ahí, este, I need uh, amenities. Sí, amenities. All service. Uh -huh, service, sí. Okay. Thank you for call, call us. We waiting for yes. you. Uh, yes, uh, I need going to need the shoulder, the Iron 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 Man Hotel. Okay. Sería sería del de la aerolínea al hotel. Sure. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. I I take your your service. Yes, I Thank need the for... service. Uh -huh. I need the service, the jeans in yes. the mini bar uh, and jacuzzi uh, and apple. Okay, only that? Uh, only. Okay. That's okay. That's okay. okay. Uh, thank you, see you soon. Uh, yes, please. Hey, excellent. Thank you. Thank you very much. Do I have another pair of volunteers? If no, Sandrita, give me a number from one to five. Uh, three. Carla, Minor, and Jonathan. Hi, hi. Jonathan, Jonathan, Carlos, Carlos, Carla. Go ahead. We are all ears. Mm -hmm. I would like to make a hotel de Cameron reservation. Sí, Cherry, puede poner la, la captura porque no la tengo. Ah, vaya, right. ok. ¿Quieren esta o la del manual? Esta. No, esta Nada. Uh, what day will you be arriving? I will be arriving on March 11. Okay. How long will you be staying? I need a single room. How many people will be staying in the room? I will be staying in the room alone. Would you like a smoking or no smoking room? I need a no smoking room. We have booked a room for you. 
please be sure to arrive before four o'clock on your checking date. I have a question. I Can need uh, I need uh, Wi-Fi in my room. Yes, in in your room is Wi-Fi. Okay, Mister. Have a good day. Okay, Mister. Okay. okay, very good, very good. Los demás se salvaron. No se han salvado. Mañana los voy a oír. Ya voy a captura de quiénes son. Pero... Vamos a ver. Ah, aquí está. Y me voy a dejar guardada la capturita yo. De quiénes son. ¿Quiénes faltan? So, tomorrow we are going to listen to you. Va, ahí está. Pasaron ahora um, Sandra y yes. Miren, aquí los tengo. Hoy vamos a poner acá ready. Y ready, ¿verdad? Es de Sandra. So we're missing group number one, two and four for tomorrow. Okay. Back. Let's see. I'm going to call the last attendance and then we can go rest a little bit. Um, Amanda. Present. Carlos Alfredo. Present. Cecilia. César. Yes, the teacher. Okay. César. Claudia Ivon. Present teacher. Claudia eh, Jacob. Jonathan. Present teacher. José David. José David estaba. No. No estaba con nadie, José David. No, no, no. Nadie, 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 no, 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 no. Juan Antonio, sí. Okay. Present. Juan Antonio present, Juan Carlos no present, Karen, Carla Yamilet, present teacher, Catherine Bridget, present teacher, Connie, Marco Rubén, Marco, ¿Alguien recuerda haber trabajado con Marco? No. No. No, teacher. Uh, minor. Sandra Elizabeth. Present. Sandra Inés. Present. Minor. Ok, Tatiana. Tatiana. No, Tatiana, ¿verdad? Y Catherine Beatriz. Present. Nice. 
Vamos a ver quién se va a quedar conmigo. Class number. Teacher, no, y que me mencionara. Después, ¿Qué? después de tanto. Las dos Silvias no las mencionó. Oh, no. Sí, <risa> Silvia Estela. Sí. No, no, present. No la mencionó. Se saltó sí. a Tatiana, solo. De no, Sandra, no Tatiana. Solo las leí para mí. Porque si las leí, no, no, no. <risa> Hey. Yo recuerdo, no dije Sandrita. No, no Sandra, eh, then other name, but no Silvia, Tatiana. Ay. Uy, solo los leí para mí. Y es que mi cerebro anda más rápido que yo, completa. Vaya. Sí, porque dije Sandra, después Silvia Estela, Silvinés. Ya no le hice solo para mí. Pero okay. sí le puse present, ¿eh? Sí le puse. Ah, thank you. <ríe> Ay, no, qué barbaridad. Ok, vaya pues. Vamos a ver, hoy le toca quedarse conmigo, Sixteen. Le toca a Minor. Yes. De hecho, una pregunta: ¿en qué tarea vamos ahorita? ¿En qué, oh. qué número de clase? Hoy tendríamos, hoy es la clase 16. Ah, ok. Ajá, tendríamos que estar en la, en la tarea 16, empezando, empezando la primera tarea de la unidad 4. Ah, gracias. Ahora, Minor, hoy. I finished the platform. Eso, sí, yo creo que I ya think. le recogí notas a usted. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good night. See you. See you, Sylvia. See you. Silvia. See you. Good, night. Good, night. Good night. Si quieren ir adelantando el examen final, ya pueden hacer. Good night, teacher. Good night. Cuidado, los tres vamos. <laughs> sí, ya casi, ya casi. Bye. Take care. Hi, minor. Hi, teacher. How are you? I'm fine. And recién llegando a mi casa. Wow, vaya, pero qué bueno que ya llegó. Oye, ¿a qué hora sale, minor? Sale noche de trabajar. Es que hoy es... Corte. Hoy es fecha de corte, por eso. Ajá. No, y hoy el tráfico sí, estaba recién. horroroso todo el día. De tráfico. No, eso ya siempre, eso ya siempre está así. Siempre. Too many cars. Todos. That's too many, too many cars. Todo no. el mundo tiene carro, entonces. Todos tienen. Uh -huh. Es un A ver, tell me, Minor. Do you have any questions, any comments? Bueno, comentarios. Bueno, question, question, no. No questions. Eh, me da pena en cierta manera porque no puedo oír las clases completamente. Sí. No participo al 100% también. Por lo mismo de que a las, a las 8 o a veces algo más tarde del trabajo. Y no puedo escucharla. Cuando se quede con alguna duda, ya sabe que la clase la suben tempranito. Sí, sí, las leo, las escucho después. Ahí la puede mm. oír para que, por así cualquier duda, que algo se le pasó y, y no lo logró escuchar completamente, ahí puede ver el video a poderse poner al día. ¿La plataforma cómo va? Eh, lo hice el viernes hasta la última actividad, si no mal recuerdo. Pero de, de ayer y de, de lunes y martes no me he puesto al día. Ya. Ahora voy a trabajar. Ah, sí, la unidad 3 le falta, ¿verdad? Me faltan tres tareas. Con la hora. Ajá. Sí, le faltan. Le falta la de viernes. 
No es el sábado. La del sábado. El sábado no hay fecha. La del viernes, la del lunes y la del martes. Ajá. Y la de hoy. ¿Verdad? Así que si, si tiene algún su ratito libre, puede aprovechar. Ya sé que de Londres, de libre, de hecho. Pero ajá, algún ratito que pueda, ¿verdad? Se puede ir adelantando el examen. Porque el otro okay. martes, en la noche, yo recojo notas incluyendo examen. ¿verdad? Entonces ahí si logra ahí adelantarse en el examen, tal vez no hoy, pero eh, tal vez el fin de semana, ¿verdad? Para para adelantarnos en el examen. Ya, por ejemplo, la parte 1 y parte 2 del examen son de la unidad 3. Entonces ya, ya, lo uh -huh, ya lo pueden hacer, porque ya lo vieron. La parte 3 y 4 son las que son de la unidad 4. Okay. Entonces, ajá. Pero ya, la, ya pueden empezar a hacer las primeras dos partes del examen para poder ir adelantando. Así que no les quede de todo eh, para el martes, ¿verdad? Porque si no, no. Si el fin de semana me voy a aprovechar. Sí, sí, porque así se, va poni así se va poniendo al día y ya tranquilamente se le revisa. ¿verdad? Así, yo siempre recojo notas martes, actualizo un lunes y otra vez martes en la noche, porque martes sin la unidad ya tienen que ir completaditos. Entonces, en martes yo doy la última revisada de cada unidad para ir checando. Ayer estuve revisando en la noche al salir de clase y sí ve que tiene 40, ¿verdad? En la unidad 3 le faltan tres ejercicios, pero son chiquitos. Eso rapidito nos los hace y hay que estar tranquilo. ¿verdad? No sé si tiene alguna pregunta, Maynard. Bueno, eh, de parte suya, con, bueno, lo, las pocas veces que también he, he participado, ¿cómo ha visto que ha sido de la participación? Fíjese que a pesar de que este, está trabajando, mejor dicho, va de camino, pero yo he escuchado, lo he escuchado activo en los grupos y eso me gusta, ¿verdad? Que... Okay que aunque vaya de camino o cualquier cosa que está pendiente se está activando en los grupos y eso es muy bueno ¿verdad? así que hay okay. que seguir así cuesta todo cuesta ¿verdad? pero es lo que más se valora lo que cuesta uh -huh. así que a seguir dando lo mejor ¿verdad? Gracias. ánimo ánimo a seguir dando lo, el mejor esfuerzo posible ¿Verdad? Y así, ni modo, ¿eh? cuando esté con los ratitos libres, oiga el video de la clase, si no lo puede estar mirando, pero tal vez aunque sea oyendo, cuando está almorzando, ¿ve? Sí, los sí, links, lo escucho. Los links también, este, todas las lecciones tienen dos links, ¿verdad? Algunos son videos que pueden, que pueden ver para para poder ir practicando más el material que se esté estudiando en clase. Porque sí, yo sé, la unidad 3 estuvo feita, ¿verdad? Pero ahí ver los videitos extra que trae el manual puede ayudar a, a mejorar esos, esos temas, ¿verdad? Ya, pues, Otra vez, bueno. uh -huh. Vaya, pues ma, no, ya no le quito más tiempo para que vaya a descansar. Y a cenar, me imagino que a cenar hasta ahorita, ¿verdad? Sí, a cenar. Sí. Vaya, pues, buen provecho. Gracias. And see you tomorrow. Bye. Take care.